I greet you in the love and the light of the infinite creator. In these videos, I explain a theory that puts forward the idea that everything is based on one universal process and biophotons can be part of this process. Biophotons are simply light that is emitted from biological materials such as the human body or any life form. These biophotons are just outside the range of visible light with shorter wavelengths and faster frequencies. Just like visible light, they are electromagnetic waves, the same as all the other waves in the electromagnetic spectrum, which ranges from radial waves that have a very long wavelength and a relative slow frequency, through to gamma rays with a very short wavelength and a fast frequency. In these videos, I say that light is a wave over a period of time and only has particle characteristics when it interacts with the atoms of the periodic table. Within such a process, the wave-particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons is forming a blank canvas that we can interact with. This gives us the potential to form the possible into the actual, with an uncertain future unfolding photon by photon. But for this process to be logical, it would have to form an interactive base for classical physics, biology, and chemistry. And this is where the biophoton comes in, by creating a certain degree of order, which is transferred by the spontaneous absorption and emission of light with the movement of charge. We have the build-up and organization of charge relative to the membrane of each living cell with hundreds of thousands of chemical reactions in each cell at any one moment. Add to this that we have tens of billions of cells in our body with unimaginable numbers of biophotons forming reactions that take nanoseconds and cause a cascade of long-standing effects. There is only one way to explain this that can make biological and chemical processes possible and logical, and that is that the future is unfolding photon by photon relative to the atoms of the periodic table and the wavelength of the light. This is difficult to comprehend because at high temperature we have a phase change of matter with charge being able to cover a large area of interstellar space in the form of plasma. There is a beautiful similarity between interstellar space and biological systems. Plasma was first discovered, they could not decide what name to give it. They thought about calling it uniform discharge or equilibrium discharge. But then someone seen the similarity of how filaments move within the discharge and the way blood plasma moves red and white blood cells around the body. So they decided to call the uniformed discharge plasma. This similarity would be logical if the cellular structure of cell life and the cellular structure of interstellar space are based on the same universal process. Please sub and share. It will help the promotion of this theory.